How can you make a great first impression with your book on Amazon when people come and check you out? In other words, how do you stand out on that multi-million member platform? Well, here are three quick tips for you. Number one, your book title. Make sure that the title, the words in your title connect with the reader that you want to connect with. If you are using obscure words, words that are creating questions, what is it? What does that actually mean? Do not necessarily draw the reader in wanting to know more or wanting to buy your book. You are much better to make sure that the words you use in your title connect exactly with that person that you want to read your book. For example, words like scary or exploit, they can have the effect you want to have if you're using those words where people think, oh, yes, I want to know about the scary or exploitation, but it can have the opposite effect if you're not really sure that your readership uses those words and it can push them back and think, oh, I don't want to know about scary. I don't want to exploit anybody. So be clear on that title that you're using. The words connect with your reader. Number two, your table of contents. People can see that straight away on Amazon when they check out your book. So that table of contents, how have you named your chapter headings? Are you taking the reader on a journey through your book so that it logically and on an emotion level makes sense to them that that is the book for them? Are your chapter headings giving away what is in that chapter? If you are using on your chapter headings, technical language or industry related language. Now marketers like to do this a lot. They don't write the book for another marketer. They write it for the business owner. And yet the words they use, for example, recently I used the marketing term opt-in, yet the person I was speaking to had no clue what that meant. That person only knew the word lead magnet. Now they are similar. They mean or guide to the same thing, but they're two different words and the person just did not know that word. So make sure when you are guiding the reader on your table of contents, your chapter headings through that they understand what the book is about and they can connect with it straight away right there and then. And number three, can people, when they check out your book already on those very first few pages that Amazon allows them to take a look at, can they already connect with you? Are you giving something away that they could access? For example, a video perhaps where you are showing who you are, like I am right here right now, or could they go and get some free gift somewhere, a download or something, and then they already can also connect and get onto your list for example. So consider those three tips with your book as making a great impact, standing out, being different when you upload and offer your book to be able to be purchased on Amazon.